All right, quick video update of the 340 millimeter EDF that I am putting together right now. I have got a lot of stuff out here on the table. I have run out of filament, so I was mixing filament as I was printing. And I I, I just said, you know what, the heck with this, I'm painting it white because I have some spray paint it'll match the blades. So I, I'm waiting for more filament so I can finish out this statter and then I can go with the outer, outer, outer casing. And then the motor mount, and then the structure that supports the motor mount, and then the ductwork possibly, or I'm just going to do a, a rigid stand so that I can test the airflow of the actual fan itself. Um, but when I do ductwork, I want to make sure that I have stators inside behind this for flow rectification that are attached to the actual motor mount that sits up here, so it kind of blends in with from, from the motor mount out to the ductwork. So that's the main plan. So that's where we're at right now. This thing is getting huge. But oh my goodness. When it spins, it's going to be pretty. Just watch that from the top real quick. You can. Oh, it's going to wiggle. I'll hold it. There we go. Yeah. Damn. That's going to look nice. But we're getting there. And I'm putting together the Arduino sensor for the RPMs. This is going to be a big fan build. I'm excited. I hope you're excited. I hope you're not bored yet. <laughs> and if you're new here, subscribe for more great content, including, you know, Deadpool and, like, the smaller fans, the 170 mils that I'm building right now. And that I'm putting together and testing. And I'm going to reprint the bottom of the dill drone because that was an epic fail. But... It was because of a low battery warning. It didn't come through. So make sure you stick around because we are far from done and there is a lot more to come.